Making history in Chatham soon, the Chatham Fire Protection District will have their first African-American female firefighter. WAD's Carly Brockma learned what inspires her and the lessons she hopes to teach other women. From office work to fighting fires. And then my coat and throw that on. Kashima's thoughts can do it all. They do a 18 month program bringing on probationary members and I'm in about the midpoint of that 18 month period. Stotts was an office manager at Chatham Fire Protection for over a decade, but was inspired to start training to become a firefighter. I watched them for the last uh, 12 years do these uh, acts without a bit of fear. Um, I respect them 100%. And she's making history, joining the team as the first African-American woman to be a Chatham firefighter. Give it a try. Don't be afraid. Uh, fire service is not just for men. It's for women. There are several women in the fire service today. While she's treated like any other member of the team. I think the guys don't treat me any differently. Many people look to Stotts for inspiration. I'm just hoping that uh, my acts, my um, things that I do may make someone else think that they can do it. Um, I'm 4'11", I'm not the biggest woman. Um, so I just hope to give people that opportunity to uh, think that they can do things just the same as I am. Whether it's encouraging women to join the team or saving members of her community, Stotts just wants to make a difference. Just going out to do a job, doing something to help the community. In Chatham, Carly Bronkema, WAND News. Stotts is about halfway through the training to become a firefighter. She hopes to be fully trained by the end of the year.